is a mobile ice pop company in Miami, Florida. An ice pop is the perfect prescription to beat that sweltering Miami heat. And fever ice pops fit the bill. Felicia Hattrick is the owner and mastermind behind Feverish. Feverish started purely by accident. She was running down the street after an ice cream truck one day. I fall flat on my face, and I get up, and two ideas come to mind. One, I'm way too old to chase after an ice cream truck. And two, why hasn't anyone come up with a cooler way for adults to enjoy ice cream? So she said, the hell with it. I want to start my own company. Feverish make all of their ice pops in a production facility. They have a little eco-friendly van and these little carts that they pack with dry ice, load them up, and they're off for the day. They might show up at a nightclub, at an art fair. You never know where they're going to pop up. What's wonderful about Feverish is that they're using these real fruits inside their ice pops. <laughs> is it like real mango? None of that artificial color and flavor that's going to stain your mouth like when you were a kid. With our pops, you're giving a layer of a different kind of texture and a different experience. At Feverish, she makes a whole variety of ice pops. You have an Arnold Palmer, which is iced tea and lemonade mix. She does the classic watermelon, locally sourced mango and lime. And then she also does a really bubbly, refreshing strawberry mojito. In Miami, mojito is king. What Felicia does with her strawberry mojito ice pop is it doesn't have the booze in it. She takes strawberries, fresh squeezed lime juice, and actually scrapes some of the pulp in with the juice. She'll put this in a blender with some mint, some soda water, and some agave nectar. She puts freshly sliced strawberries into the bottom of the mold of the pop, pours all this beautifully pureed strawberry mojito on top, freezes it. This pop is really fruity and really refreshing. It's yummy, it's the real fruit, you know. It may not get you drunk, but it's good. I never thought I'd say this. I think I enjoy the strawberry mojito ice pop more than an actual strawberry mojito. The Arnold Palmer is one of those refreshing drinks that you always want on a hot summer's day. When you get the Arnold Palmer, you're licking this really refreshing combination of the tart citrus from the lemon and the earthiness of the tea. Now the great thing is that she adds tamarind, so it really gives it this special kick in your mouth. Tamarind is like a giant bean pot, but it has this real citrusy, kind of spicy kick to it. So all of that kind of tartness comes out in the tea. To that she adds freshly squeezed lemon juice, vanilla, and agave nectar. When you bite into it, obviously it tastes like iced tea and lemonade put together. But that lemonade is really you know, robust because that tamarind flavor is just so pungent. Enjoying an Arnold Palmer ice pop poolside? Could there be anything better? No, I do not think so. No. One of my favorite ice pops is the chocolate banana sea salt ice pop. The texture is really luscious. You wouldn't know that there was no dairy in it because it's, it's creamy, it's kind of milk chocolatey. She starts off with really super ripe bananas. She puts those in a blender with almond milk. She'll add some cocoa mix. Then what she'll do is add some sea salt. Adding the sea salt is going to draw out even more flavors from the chocolate, the banana, and the almond all together. Then she takes sliced bananas puts them inside the mold, and she freezes it. You have that salty taste, you have a little bit of chocolate, and then you get these little pieces of frozen banana. It's creamy, it's chewy, it's not usually what you'd expect from an ice pop. What's unique about Feverish is that she's taking something very simple and using really interesting fruits and highlighting the flavor of the fruit. I love ice pops because it cool me down instantly. So if you're feeling feverish, hey, you gotta cool down with something. And for me, that's the reason I love what I do. What I love about Touch